According to the Cebu City Health Office, North District had the most roadside water vending machines among the five districts. And out of the barangays, Barangay Apas was chosen via random sampling. A physical inventory was done and showed 56 roadside water vending machines within the barangay and all were included in the study. The collected water samples were subjected to a microbiological analysis which included the required measures based on the PNSDW of 2017 total coliform, the presence of E. coli, and heterotrophic plate count. E. coli is a bacteria commonly found in feces and is an indicator for fecal contamination. HPC is a measure of the amount of heterotrophic bacteria found in a water sample. Total coliform signifies a measure of coliforms which is a group of closely related species found in feces and the environment. This serves as an indicator for the cleanliness and integrity of the water distribution system and the degree of disinfection from water treatment. The results showed that all samples failed the microbiological assessment because they did not meet the standard levels. The study concluded that unregulated water vending machines, such as those found in the streets of Cebu, are not safe for human consumption as they are bacterially contaminated. With the data gathered in this study, it can impact the regulation and consumption of drinking water from water vending machines found on the roadside which may benefit the consumers.